Adesua Etomi Wellington blasts President Buhari's aide, Loretta Onochi, for the caption she tweeted with a disturbing photo of very young, less privileged kids wearing cut-up cardboard over their faces as attempted face masks. Loretta tweeted this photo saying, wearing a face mask is not a political statement. It's not punishment by government. Protect yourself. Wear one. And referring to the kids in the photo, she then continues to say, these have made efforts with masking where those of us who are more vulnerable and susceptible to COVID-19 are still swearing that it's a scam. God bless their efforts. Now, this tweet significantly ruffled Adesua's feathers, and she did not hold back in expressing herself. She responded with a couple tweets saying to Loretta, you are a disgrace, both home and abroad. You should be ashamed that these children have to do this with cardboard. Instead of talking about how to tackle poverty so they can be protected adequately against the virus, you're spewing this nonsense. She then continues by adding, this picture made me so angry and brought tears to my eyes. They're so small, so vulnerable, and so unprotected. Ugh, this country. Mm. This country now. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly understand her disappointment and frustration. Like, I believe um, Loretta had a chance to, you know, address poverty. She had a chance to address the fact that these kids should be provided for in regards to, you know, proper sanitation and proper protection from the virus. But no, she's kind of like, I don't want to say she's glorifying mm. their current state, but she could have taken a different approach when addressing yeah, that photo. Sure. What do you guys think? I think the picture was just the... It, huh. what, what, what Loretta said, I didn't find any problem with it. Mm. It's the fact that she used children mm. who are really poor and struggling to um, um, push that point. Because it's really insensitive. It means that your point was more important than the picture that we saw. You know, sometimes, it, like, even if you want to go about something... You should not be too tone deaf to realize yeah, exactly. that this is, is not going to work. Like, this is a bit too insensitive, uh -huh. if you ask me. So I feel like um, uh, you are, you're, you're just very detached. And I, I think sometimes people who have a lot of... If, I've noticed with people who have a very, like, extreme something, like an extreme privilege, if you're, like, really um, beautiful or, like, really rich or really popular, those type of people sometimes get too detached yes. from reality yeah. and like what is happening and to the shows in the way they, they express themselves and i think that's this lady's problem yeah uh, in regards to uh Adesua. Adesua. wow damn <laughs> she went off she did not like even try to like warm me word. do you understand like she wasn't even that's something i know I'm, I'm, I'm it's not my strength even when i'm really upset i'm still thinking about how i'm not gonna hurt your yeah. feelings like i'm because I, I don't care about you yeah. but if i you know no, usually i'm like and eh, you know i'm upset but like well it's half my whatever you, she was just like race both internationally i want you to know here. i want you to know that i can't stand your guts Yikes. and we're not friends i'm not trying to keep an open space mm. for like conversation this that you've done is a no-no i i really respect that yeah Dear Mrs. Loretta on a chair. <laughs> Dear madam. Open letter. So when I saw this, I read the post first. The picture is always underneath, obviously. I saw it, but I read the post first. Mm. And uh, when I saw it, I was like, okay, you make a sense, ma'am. And then I saw and those then. kids, and those kids then look like your kids. Do uh. you understand? Mm. That was where I felt really sad. Would you be proud of your own kids having cat buds and their noses on their faces to mm. protect themselves against the virus? Mm. You probably have your kids locked up somewhere. You probably have your kids making sure that they're good, making sure that they have one full carton of face mask, even if they can't use it every day. Mm. They get that. Now, you put those kids out there. First thing you should have done was like, I saw this picture, I searched for those kids, I found them a face mask, mm. and then you post this. Do you understand? And say, mm. wearing a face Make mask is not a political exactly. statement. That's, oh, that's, that's why on your head this morning. <laughs> but where yeah. is the love? Mm. Where is the leadership? Mm. Where is the leading by example? Mm. Where is you showing us that you are a true leader? Where is mm. you showing us that you appreciate us for putting you into power? Yeah. And even mm. your bosses. Mm. I'm not just talking to you now because every other person handling this 
that saw this and didn't come for you on your team, they are all a disgrace, including you, ma'am, without no respect, ma'am. That was hot. <laughs> that was so hot. So She's we can clearly <laughs> see why Adesua was frustrated. I mean, yeah. that was a missed opportunity. Yeah. Like Ifa said, th she worst. had so much potential. Yeah. She could have, you know, made got the best exactly. Story. Yeah, absolutely. But I'm proud of my celebrities. You know, sometimes a lot of these people they don't come hold out. Back. Mm -hmm. They don't and, hold and, back. And sometimes it, I feel like. Um, what's it called? They don't always speak for us in the right way. We've yeah. seen recently how these celebrities have really fallen in our hands. But I think that we have to give um, Adesua big uh, congratulations on this one. Not only did she even make the effort to do what she did, but she did it really well. I think she, she, let, let, she let her know that this is a serious matter. So, I, I, I mean, poverty is something that is not a very entertainment topic, but that's yeah. something that... You know, we can't really remove from this conversation. We can't it, for sure. And if that's your responsibility to try and elevate that, then why didn't you even put that somewhere in your in your speech? Like if she even added, it's so sad that these kids you could have just added a line, two lines to make the sandwich really complete, but she didn't. And okay. that's cost her to draw, to get on tea time. <laughs> Shout out to you, Adi So I thank you for being as expressive as you are. Please don't hold back. Keep it coming.